Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel SSC Selector. In today's video, we are going to learn about something about remainder. And what is remainder that will explain in the next slide. The question is 232323 23 divided by 99. So let's see how we can solve this question. First, we'll learn what is remainder and then we'll solve this question. First, let us understand what is remainder. A number, let's say 36 divided by 7. 7 5 is a 35, 1. That is the remainder. Now, if there are two numbers given in addition, for example, 22 plus a certain number, let's say 18, divided by 7. So find out the remainder. 22 divided by 7, 7 3 is a 21, 1 and 18, 7 2 is a 14, 4. So the remainder for the first number is 1, second number is 4, remainder will be 1 plus 4, 5. And if you add the two numbers, that gives us 22 plus 18 is 40. And 40 divided by 7 gives remainder as 5. So either you add the numbers or you individually find out the remainder and the sum of the remainder will be the answer. So friends, in multiplication also, we can apply this method. For example, if the number is 25, or the number is eight divided by seven, when you divide 25 by seven, seven threes are 21, remainder is four. Eight divided by seven, remainder is one. And therefore, the final remainder will be 4 into 1 is 4. And if you multiply the two numbers, 200 divided by 7, 7 to the 14, 7 8 is 56, remainder is 4. So this theorem can be applied in multiplication as well as addition and combination of the two also. 25 into 8 plus 16 divided by 7. The divisor can be anything. Here I have taken the value as 7. Just now we have seen that the remainder when 25 divided by 7 is 4. And 8 divided by 7, the remainder is 1. And 16 divided by 7, the remainder is 2. So the final remainder will be 4 into 1 plus 2. 4 ones are 4 plus 2 is 6. And even if you multiply and add the number, 25 8 is 200 plus 16 is 216. When divided by 7, you get the same remainder, that is 6. Applying this rule, we'll solve this question. Let's see how we can solve this question. 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, divided by 99. Now, two, this can be expanded as 2, 3 into 10,000 plus 2, 3 into 100 plus 2, 3, that is 23 divided by 99. And this can be written as 100 square plus 23 into 100 plus 23 divided by 99. The first number 23 divided by 99 is 23 only. 100 square, 100 divided by 99 is one. So it can be written as one square. 23 divided by 99 is 23. 100 divided by 99 is 1. And this is 23. Multiplication of 23 into 1 is square is 23. 23 into 1 is 23. 23. So the final answer comes out to be 69. The answer is 69. There are 3 times 23 and divide by 99. So answer is 69. Suppose we generalize this question for any particular number. 23 is occurring 50 times because there are 100 digits and this is a two digit number. So 23 is occurring 100 times or 50 times. 50 times 100 digits divided by 99. So the answer will be 23 plus 23 plus 23, 50 times. 23 into 50. 
5 3 is a 15, 5 2 is a 10, 11, 50 by 99. Now again, this number can be written as 11 into 100 plus 50 divided by 99. And 100 divided by 99 is 1. 11 divided by 99 is 11. So 11 into 1 plus 50, that is 61. So the final answer of this question is 61. And uh, we can generalize this for three digit number. 231, 231, 231, 60 digits, that is 20 times, each digit occurring 20 times. Same, same method we can apply, for example, 231, 231 is given, divide by 999, 231 into 1000 plus 231 upon 999. 231 divided by 99 is 231. 1000 divided by 999 is 1. 231 divided by 999 is 1. 231. So 231 is occurring twice. So in this case, it is 20 times. 231 occurring 20 times divided by 999. So the final answer will be 231, 20 divided by 999. Value is 2 ones are 2 3 are 6 2 2 are 4 divided by 999. And again, this can be written as 4 into 1000 plus 620 divided by 999. 4 divided by 999 is 4. 1000 divided by 999 is 1. And 620 divided by 999 is 620. So the final answer comes out to be 624. And this root can be applied when the digits, repeating digits may be different and number by which we have to divide is 99 or 999. For example, the number can be 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 divided by 999, 99, certain number of times. So we can apply the similar approach. I hope friends, you like this video. Please like to our videos and subscribe to our channel.